Hello, my name is Effendi and I play the clarinet in the Cleveland Orchestra. I started playing clarinet in my middle school band program at the age of 13. I chose it because of its versatility in playing jazz, orchestral, or folk music. If you're thinking about playing the clarinet, you want to keep a few things in mind. It doesn't matter if you're right-handed or left-handed. Your right thumb goes beneath what we call the thumb rest. Your left hand goes on top, and our fingers hover over the tone holes. To make a sound on the clarinet, you want to place your top teeth on top of the mouthpiece, and then using the muscles of our lips, we'll surround the mouthpiece just as we would a drinking straw. This is called our embouchure. Be careful not to use too much upward jaw pressure against the reed. The reed is a very delicate piece of bamboo, and it's the main source of our sound. You want to keep a few extra reeds on hand in case they break. And one more tip. To keep the air in motion, we want a healthy intake of air. Take a deep breath, and without puffing out your cheeks, imagine that you're blowing out a candle from six feet away. In the following example from Prokofiev's Romeo and Juliet, listen to the way I connect the notes smoothly using a gentle airstream. This is what we call legato. One of the things I like most about playing an instrument is having the opportunity to blend with other instruments that work differently from my own. A friend in the orchestra recently reminded me how rewarding it is to create a new tone from combining two or more instruments together and become something greater than any one of us. Now is a great time to learn how to play an instrument. Which one will you choose? <laughs>